locked in the game. Sports it's in the game. A meaningful occasion and all week long the football chatter has centered around this game and these talented teams which one will outwit the other in a packed and passionate stadium so many questions to be answered on a day of destiny stay tuned for all the action and a warm welcome on what is a fine day for Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the gantry today, no rain in sight. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. And the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion. It's into Miami, and they face Al Nasser. Well, as always, I'm looking forward to this because both teams have strong aspects to their game. Both managers like to play attacking football, and we've got some good matchups all over the pitch.
Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Well, they're going to play with two wingers in this 4 3 3 formation, so they need to switch the ball quickly and get crosses into the box. But they also need to get at least two midfield players making runs into the penalty area. That's a must. And introducing the visitors' lineup today. Well, in this 4 5 1 shape, it will be interesting to see how close the wide midfield players get to their main striker. Will they stay wide or play through the inside right and inside left positions? We'll have to wait to see how it develops. Thank you for joining us today. Enjoy the match. And a warm welcome on what is a fine day for football. Well, it's even Stephen after an entertaining first half. Will we get a winner in the second 45? Played through nicely. Now, this has to be. And it's in. It's no longer goalless. There's the opener. Well, here's the replay, and it's an inch-perfect pass, this is. Shows great awareness to set up the chance. And Messi shows great awareness to get on the end of it. And when he's through 1v1 with the goalkeeper, he fires it past him. Goal. So off we go at 1-0. Alex Telles. Able to skip past. Tellez. Oh, good defending just when it was looking threatening. Nicely. Otavio. Abdullah Al Khaibari. Sadio Mane now. Usually plays keep ball better than anyone, Busquets, but not then. Good idea. Messi just needs to remain composed. And that's the hat-trick. Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him. Well, let's see this again. What a pass this is from Suarez. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. showed moments of quality they worked hard but overall they'll be happy with the result and the performance well good marks today as ever for Lionel Messi's performance more than satisfactory yeah I thought he was a constant threat his movement was good and created a lot of chances just needed to be a bit more composed in front of goal but he did get one and the team won so I'm sure he's smiling
ends in a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. And it's a pretty good save by the... Now, this has to be. And it's in. It's no longer goalless. There's the opener. And this could be. In behind, can he finish? This has to be. And this confrontation is underway. Lionel Messi. He takes aim. And what a magical save it was! Well, I must say, I thought they were about to illuminate the scoreboard with the. And he's broken free! In position and just like that Lionel Messi has scored the first goal was always going to be important Messi ball is loose and there it is an almost intuitive piece of finishing that's a good pass Lionel Messi's got past the defenders. Another goal! And surely there's no way they can throw this away. Absolutely dominant. Good idea. Messi just needs to remain composed. And that's the hat-trick. Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him.